Hello, Pokemon fans! I'm Professor K. And I'm Ed. And we are back with more Champions Path. But this time, we have built ourselves a custom booster box out of Dubwool, Hatterene, and Marnie boxes. Maybe we mix it up a little bit. Yeah, we've opened up so much of a specific product that, like, it just didn't feel right to continue doing so. And uh, we'll give you guys something a little bit different, at least a different style of approach, and give you a bunch of packs in one opening instead of just random boxes, so. Yeah, especially with Shining Fates coming along. <laughs> Yes, very much so. All right, we're going to divide this right in half. So if there was 12, then that should be right down the middle. All right. Should give us a total of 18 apiece. Who's going first, you or me? Heads, I go first. Tails, you go first. Okay. It looks like it's heads. All right. It looks like I'm going first. All right. So Champions Path has been a very interesting set for us. We've had a lot of videos that have done exceptionally, excuse me, exceptionally well uh, for pulls. And then we've had some that were just absolutely terrible. So it remains to be seen what we're going to get today, but we'll find out. Matter of fact, I think after this pack, I'm probably just going to go to a standard uh, style of opening where we don't have to go through the cards one by one because you guys have seen so much of this set. And again, I don't even know why. This is a very small set. Yeah, it's a very small set and like I said, there's no need to slow roll it, I don't think. I think we're just gonna kind of fan them out there and show what we get. Incineroar! Which right off the bat, that rewards us with a pull. Incineroar V. That's actually one of the few Vs that's actually not that common to pull. Yeah, that one and uh, we, we've Venusaur. talked about it before, Venusaur is the other one and ironically we pulled two of each in another video right after we said that so who knows well maybe we'll get the same thing happen again <laughs> there's an energy there there's your favorite hollow uh, alongside your actual favorite reverse hollow oh yeah definitely but it's not that him but shot it's just that artwork looks so gross yeah like i'm not a fan of that art at all it definitely could have been better and then we've seen it so much because it's like one of the most that common that also, there's also a thing that hurts it a lot too. Sent to Scorch. Ooh, Dragon Squad. Where did that come from, by the way? I meant to ask you. I mean, there's such thing as a Squirrel Squad, so when I call it Scraggy Squad. Okay, so that was like your own creation? Yeah. Okay. That makes a lot more sense, because I was like, where? I, is there something that I'm missing? Nah. Okay. Professor Research. I'm not ah, a hat. I create a lot of my own things. I'm, I'm not doubting that in the slightest. I mean, most of the stuff we've gotten from the channel has come from you. So, you've created a lot of random names and things over the years. There's another Machamp. Yeah, I'm glad we didn't. <laughs> we decided not to slow roll because we would have gotten through a lot of hollows that I'm sure nobody wants to see. Yeah. <laughs> Believe me, we know when something's been burnt out. And this has definitely been one of those mm -hmm. sets that have been burnt out. So, so I wish it would have like generations, like keep, like keep it up for longer. Because, like, yeah, we did get some some stuff with it like there was like some things that came out later and later but it wasn't it didn't feel like that long not compared to like hidden fates or generations shining legends also yeah shining legends yeah scrafty yeah i think generations went on for like almost a year yeah it did it went on for almost the entire year and who knows i mean whatever we get for the 20th anniversary set it might be something similar i mean we haven't really gotten full details on what that's going to be like i mean isn't yet. that shining fates no there's another huh so well isn't this one of the 25th anniversary 25th anniversary yeah man quarter of a century old man, that's nuts and it's go figure it out it's around this era right now where it's almost as popular as it was back then yeah it really is wow i am literally getting nothing <laughs> you got incineroar you didn't even sleeve it no i did not you're right that's a good call out i did not sleeve it but lots of hollows. I have said it's a dreadnought grapple. We've pulled hundreds of those. That's also true. Alright. Lycan Rock. Man, the hollows are everywhere. Well, at least we're getting good at separating out our bulk. <laughs> very true, very true. Because we're literally doing it in real time as we're opening up these packs. And this is definitely a very bulk heavy set ah dreadnought we've literally pulled the full art more than the actual like regular <laughs> version of it we really have that's the funny part about all of this is that like we've seen more full art dreadnoughts 
than we've seen regular Dreadnoughts. I actually forgot what regular Dreadnought looks like. I can remember it slightly, but like, if I had to like draw it from memory or something, if I could draw, I would not be able to. That is for sure. Lycanroc and Senta Scorch alongside of that. Energy there. Man, oh man, oh man. Well, I'm glad that uh, this isn't a real pack battle because uh, I am five packs. What are you talking left. about? It's always a pack battle with you and me. Oh man, I was hoping you were going to call this one not because there's no way I'm going to uh, grab lot. Hey, guess what that means? Something in Twitch. It means something in the Twitch chat. How long will it take for Grovile? I have to say it. <laughs> How much of a delay is there in the stream? There it is. Dang it. <laughs> oh, man. He had to say one of the most common ones. I love Dugong. That's right, you do. <laughs> All right. And Hatterene. Well, darn. I only have three packs left out of 18. I know that maybe mine won't be better. Eh. I mean, either that or maybe I gave you all the good pulls. Who knows? Watch him give me a nice sharp start. I'm telling you. It, I, I feel like that's exactly what's going to happen. I really do feel like that's exactly what's going to happen. Honestly, I think that Rainbow Razor is going to go down a lot of price. Oh, it will. Yeah. Because Shiny it, Faith gives us the Shiny VMAX Charizard. It already has gone down. That's the crazy part. Like, it was a $500 card. Now it's like $300. I, it's, I think it really is because of Shining Faith. Because... Do people's preference, they would much rather have a shiny version of it than the Rainbow Rare. But even the shiny V has gone down. So, that's all I got. I think that's because we're getting another shiny V. I could be wrong. I haven't heard anything about that. I could be wrong, but I think, I think I've think heard that we might be getting one. I did. That's just like offhand rumor. I'm just thinking about it. I could very well be wrong. Yeah, I haven't heard anything about that, so I have no idea. <laughs> but I hope you have better luck than me. Because 3 out of 15, or 18, is terrible. That's actually double odds. Yeah. Alright, so we got Reverse Altaria and Scraggy. I'll handle your, uh... Fun. Bulk, since I'm over here. Of course, that one turns around the other way. Of course it does, right? Skizzlepeed, and we have a Research. They could have at least increased the, uh, the odds a little bit for the other ones besides Charizard. I feel like the odds have been awful lately. And I turn it around and it comes around again. Alright, I'm going to turn it back this way. Let's leave it that way. <laughs> Zygarde and Obstagoon. Alright. This over here. <laughs> I don't think that's how you spell cat. Not what he was spelling. What was he spelling? He spelled cat. That's an actual word. Yeah, but that's not... That's not what he was trying to spell. What was he trying to spell? Quack. Quack. Oh. <laughs> we got Lucas's hangman game for uh, that's Christmas. That's an actual travel word. Yeah, that is a real word. That is a real word. He spelled uh, Q-A-T. Yeah, wait. I had a box. Quack is with a C-K, buddy. Box. Yeah, you can have the box. That's fine. Yeah. Boxes are fun. Uh, you might win. This is, yeah, wow. <laughs> when his pulls, he might win. I remember when we first started the channel, we did a TCG opening of a Phantom Forces booster box where I got nothing, mm -hmm. 36 codes. I feel like this will be like the worst booster box of champion. It was at this moment that he knew he up. Oh, oh my gosh. That was a shock. I feel like this will be like the worst Booster box. I was literally just saying how it was the worst. Well, I win. <laughs> I win. <laughs> give me the sleeve. Give me the top loader. Get the heck out of here. Give me the top loader. Um, they still want hundreds, so the top loaders are actually um in the top drawer. I was literally just saying that it would be the worst, and it's not. <laughs> nope. Well, wow. once again, guys, I'm a great one. 
Wow, I just can't. That's secret rare number four. We have a playset of secret rares now. Hold on. Of uh, actual playsets. <laughs> oh my goodness. You can keep going. I'm, I'm just looking. See if I can find it. There they are. <laughs> you guys, if we wanted to, we could build the Charizard V deck and just bling it out. Mm hmm. <laughs> this is the ninth Charizard overall that we have pulled. Where are my V Maxes? I think I just had, a, had two of them there. There's two. There's a V Max. I've traded two of them away. So there should be five in my hand, but there's three because I've traded two away. So that's literally nine. Nine Charizards. What the actual heck? Unbelievable. Oh, stream froze. What? No balls bling the Charizard deck. <laughs> oh man, oh man, oh man. Well, I feel like we gotta get a tenth now because it's gotta be even, five and five. Really does. Oh, I almost did a trick. Unbelievable. I almost did a trick. Oh, I need to send them in, but honestly, it's not even worth doing right now because everything is backed up so much that, like, oh, yeah. it would take eight years just to get these things graded. A 4-3 line, that's true. I could do a 4-3 line because I have exactly that. I mean, you don't really play four VMAXs. So that's that's a good point. <laughs> oh, I don't believe it. Do not believe it. Yeah, it, me neither. I I would call hacks if I watch any other YouTube channel do this. Oh yeah, that's right. We Girl Wild had to say I love dugong again. I don't even know what that was. Uh, there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I think he did it like on his sixth or so pack. So 24 packs. In. Yeah. Oh, man. Well, that was us just a second ago. Team Yell. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I mean, hey, can you blame me? There goes the microphone again, I'm sure. We probably destroyed it. Probably. It'll be worth quite a bit in a few years. Yeah, I'm sure. I mean, it's shiny Charizard. It definitely will have value. Absolutely. Insane. <laughs> we have almost a stim check right there. <laughs> I think they're worth 350 right now, so technically we need two of them. All right, nothing there in Altaria. Of course, prices change all the time, so it could have gone up again for all I know. Yep. Cars or cars will always have some kind of value. That's right. I got both one side of the cards, um, but... Unfortunately, Sal, there wouldn't be a way to clip the Charizard because there's no clips allowed in subscriber streams. So there's no way to do that. However, it will be in a video, as most people on YouTube that are watching this now are finding out. <laughs> what? Well, even just now we're oh, like flipped upside down. Nada. Hey, we got the Charizard. I don't care if we get nothing from here on out. That's uh, a W. It is, it is. You're not wrong. Grap locked! Hey, guess what, Girl Vile? Another grap locked. Oh, Girl Vile. Oh, come on! <laughs> that's like, well, yeah, that's three times. That's three times. <laughs> you gotta love it. Pull another Charizard just for the heck of it. <laughs> I gotta watch if I imagine if I actually did. Wait, no, the secret is we have to say that this is the worst box in history. And this, then this is the worst pack in history right here. Absolutely the worst pack of champions pack it's gonna be, ever exist. It's gonna be garbage. Oh darn. <laughs> hey, it was garbage because there's a trubbish. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Too funny. Alright, now this, is this last, the last pack? This is my last pack. Alright. Give me trash. I only want to show it. Yeah, we're just gonna we're just gonna cut the video right it. here. Hey, it was trash. It was. <laughs> Our reverse psychology did not work that time. <laughs> we still got it to work once, though. We did get it to work once, and it was completely unintentional. I really thought that we were gonna end up with nothing, <laughs> and then here comes the boom. 
<laughs> Charizard V Secret Rare. That's stupid. Absolutely ridiculous. I mean, I'm just looking at it real quick to see what kind of great ability that looks like on the centering alone. The centering is off. Just, well, more than a hair, actually. No! So, for those of you who are looking to grade cards, the first thing you want to look at before you even look at quality of the card is the centering. So if you look at the border on this side, you can tell that it's thicker than the border on this side by maybe a millimeter or two. Uh, it, it's enough to notice with the without taking out a ruler and actually checking. So this alone would definitely take a PSA 10 down to a 9. Like, that's right off the bat, one point gone. Which is... It's a little unfair. It is, but, I mean, it's that's the whole thing, though. For anything to be gem mint, it has to be perfect. And it's not gem mint. It will be near mint or mint, but not quite there yet. And then, of course, that's when you start looking at the corners. You start looking for scratches, surface issues, uh, looking at the back to see what the back looks like, that sort of thing, whitening. So this would not grade a 10. It would be a 9 at the best if we can help it. But still... Ciao, it's Fourth secret rare, uh, shiny. <sighs> Nuts. I need to just buy a whole bunch more champions back for myself and just sell all the as I pull. <laughs> well, I mean, if you think about the amount of money that we've spent on Champions Path, did we break even? Maybe. Just maybe. I, I, I don't even know if we go over or we break even. So it's a high risk, high reward situation depending That's on how much. That's very true. So very cool that we pulled another one though for you guys. One last. Well, not one last, because we have more, but one of the last hurrahs that we have of this set. Mm -hmm. Very nice. All right, guys. Well, thank you very much for watching. We hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. Comment down below. Subscribe for more TCG content. Join us on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Evolutionaries. Same for the Discord, discord.gg slash Evolutionaries as well. That's where we post all of our notifications for stuff, and we got a great community of people, so. What's that? Paul and the Charles. Oh, okay. I was gonna say I didn't know I don't know why you were slapping a wet noodle. <laughs> Did you pull the Charizard? <laughs> I pulled a few. You pulled more than me? No. Then hush. Alright guys, look at that. <laughs> Hope you all have a fantastic day. <coughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Our reactions to people coughing now are very different than they used to be. See you guys next time. Have a great Woo! day. <laughs>